What's good, y'all? Make sure y'all go subscribe to my new channel, Space Scene That. It's been growing super, super fast. Been getting a lot of love on that channel. If you like crazy, funny videos, go subscribe right now. Go show your boy some love and have some fun. Now let's get back to this money in DFS. Let's get it. Let's get it, y'all. Let's get it. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? This your boy DCPRT, aka DFS Space of the DFS Club. Let's get into today's slate. Like my video, comment your favorite player for today's slate, and subscribe to my channel. Appreciate all the love. Please hit that like button for me. It goes a long way. It just shows appreciation for my hard work, you know, for the WNBA. Not too many people doing this. Um, and also, if you want to donate, hit that super thanks. It's right beside the um, like and dislike button down below. It's a little heart icon if you want to donate. I appreciate it. And uh, I will also shout you out in the next video. So, that's that. Also, subscribe to my other channel, Spacing That. Um, it's going crazy. So, make sure you subscribe to that channel. Uh, click the link down below to go subscribe to that channel. And uh, let's get into it. So, um... I'm gonna go over DraftKings FanDuel and also prize picks. We only got two teams playing. It's the, uh, the Chicago Sky and the uh, Liberty. Who y'all think gonna win? I think I think the Chicago Sky gonna just handle business, man. But um, we did um okay um last slate um I had got 17 plays on FanDuel. Let me go ahead and show y'all that. So I got 17 plays making a making a dub. On FanDuel, um, missed on DK, um, but overall profit. DJ 24 cash on DK, making 30 bucks. Papa Cash said he took down. Shout out to Papa Cash. Want to give a shout out to other people, man, uh, playing other sports. So, uh, Jigga Josh, I think this is tennis right here. He made $405. Shout out to Jigga Josh. Um, Sinzy Kid. Making $32 total. Cash like what? Five, six lines right here. Uh, ZZ made 30 bucks. Uh, finishing sixth place. Brace fan 89 making 30 bucks. Finishing 13th place. Julio, uh, shout out to Julio. Um, finished seventh place. Making 400 bucks on MLB. Then turn around, made another hundred, so that's five hundred. And then turn around again, made sixty, so that five hundred sixty dollars total for Ju uh, for Julio. Shout out to Julio. Spitter Beans made two twenty seven on MLB. And Big Ben twenty one dollars. So shout out to y'all, man. Let's get into it for M uh for WNBA. Also, if you want to join the winning team, the DFS Club, go to dfsclub.com. You got me, Skywalker DFS, my brother. Join the community with over 535 plus members. Shout out to the family. We have fun in the chat. We play every single sport, NBA, NFL, MLB, PGA, NHL, tennis, NASCAR, soccer, eSports, MMA, WNBA, college sports, Euroball, basketball, SFL. Click join now. Click my logo. We got four plans. We got the bronze plan, silver plan, gold plan, and three-day pass. If you want to try us out, we're the cheapest in the industry. Come join the fun, man. We build lineups. If you want to play my lineups, you can. Also, pre-light insight. We'll be on top of the news. Any late scratches we need to make, you know, I will let y'all know. Because y'all know how basketball can get with these late scratches. 24-7 tips and advice. GPP CAD cheat sheets. Bankroll management, if you need help with that. Live pre-game podcast. We'll do a podcast. Uh, depending on what sport we cover you can hear us live on mic talking about the sport going over it man to try to take down these contests so join the winning team the dfs club we'll be glad to have you i will be going over draft kings fan duel and also prize picks a lot of people be hitting on prize picks so i'm gonna cover prize picks first since y'all love playing it i got a promo code my promo code is space s-p-a-c-e into that end and prize picks to give you a deal the deal is they got a 100 percent deposit match going on right now 
up to $100. So whatever you deposit is going to double in your account. So it's free money they're giving out just by using my promo code SPACE, S-P-A-C-E. But how to play is you got to pick at least two, three, or four players. Two players, if you get them right, so say if you like Kenneth Parker, you think she's going to get over 35.5 fantasy points, and Sabrina over 36.5, just come down here and place your bet. So 20 bucks turn into 60, 90 dollars turn into 270. It's three times your money. So whatever you deposit, whatever, so whatever you enter is going to be three times your money. Ten dollars equal thirty dollars. The minimum you can enter is five dollars, all the way up to whatever you want to do. It's going to be three times your money. Three players, if you get them right. Same example, but you're making five times your money this time. So, for example, if you want to put up $5,000, you can. You can make $25,000. $500 turns into $2,500. $50 turns into $250. $5 turns into $25. Five times your money if you get three players right. And four players, if you get them right, is the maximum amount you can make on prize picks, which is 10 times your money. So, just by getting four players right, all you need is four players right, you can make 10 times your money. So, $5 turns into $50. You know, you can do $60. It don't matter. It's going to be 10 times your money. Like I told you, I got a promo code. Make sure you enter, enter that promo code to dub your money. Automatic. Space, S-P-A-C-E. And you can play multiple sports. MLB, soccer, MMA, NFL coming up. You know, so if you play other sports, you can better those sports also. So the two picks I like for today is... um. Candace Parker and them, they're going, they're going, they, they trying to get the team out of here, man. So I'm gonna um take the over on, I'm gonna take the over on Stevens, man. They can't stop her. She been balling out 20. I'm gonna take the over on Stevens, and I take the over on Candace Parker, 35.5. Uh, and I get one more pick, maybe. Um, I guess you can go with Laney at 19.5. It's a must win for both teams, so. They're not going to be playing around. And um, those are my picks on prize picks. All right, let's get into it. So the way I'm, tar so the way I'm targeting this, I'm going to go Chicago heavy because they just play well with each other. They pass the ball. You know, um, they rack up the FS points off their assist. Kenneth Parker can assist good. Vanish Luke can assist good. Quig Quigley can assist good. Um, they, just, they just work well together, so I'm more Chicago heavy than New York. Sabrina, um, you know, she's going to be, she probably going to be chalky. So, what I like to do is, with showdowns, sometimes you, sometimes you may have to make that sacrifice. Now, Sabrina, you know, you can put in a lineup with Kenneth Parker, but if you can't fit everybody that you want, Come off a stud that you know that could possibly dud on you. Um, they got that potential. Now she got 70 point upside. This girl don't scored 70 points before. But as y'all can see, two out of three games, she got a 14 and a 15. So if she high, highly owned, like 80, 90%, and you fade that and she get a 14, not a guarantee she's gonna do that. But if she do that, you 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 pretty much cash. Pretty much. I don't see. And you got to weigh it out, too. So, see, I don't see Kenneth Parker getting a 14. These prob these these two probably the top, top two studs. Everybody else is like a tier under. So, if I'm going to pick, if I had to pick one, you can pick both if you want to. Um, but to save some salary, if you want to save some salary and even your um, stuff out, because there's, there's a lot of good players in here. And you don't have to sacrifice like playing like dumpster diving players like that might not get no minutes. You might have to come off of, uh, come off of a superstar, and the one I would come off of is Sabrina because she most likely could do it than Candace Parker. That's how I be thinking. And then you want to get different anyways in showdowns. She could go for sixty. I mean, they playing at home too. She can be motivated. But y'all know what I'm. Y'all get what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. So that's a little strategy I use. You know, I look at, I don't look at the upside. I look at the, I look at the, the downside and go off that. And then if I need to fade them, I fade them. But when I start constructing my lineups, if I can fit both of them in, I'll put them both in. But if I can't, just like I described, just I will fade the stud that most likely could fail on you. You know. 
And plus, I'm, sh I'm Chicago heavy, so, you know, Parker, Vanderslew, Copper, most con most consistent. Maybe maybe Stevens or Quigley, you know. Um, I fill in with a New York player, maybe like Laney or something. She uh five five. You don't know what you gonna get out of her either, but she only five five. She it's not like she ten k. She showed her upside. She showed the floor. But she showed her upside, but the thing is, she on the five five. She on fifty five hundred, so you know she don't really have to do much. But we do know she got the upside, um, and she gonna be ready to ball too. Now, if you like New York and you want to go against the grain, because I think the ownership is gonna lean lean towards the Chicago side. So if New York do what they did um, the first game, because they did pretty good the first game they played New York. You know, the ownership is going to be on your side. You can do Sabrina, uh, Natasha Howard. Um, really just those two. You, you, then you can do Copper. You can go mid-range right here. Um, however you want to do it. You know, there's all kind of ways to go. Oh, like this. Boom. All kind of ways to go, or you can do Sabrina Parker. You can go top heavy and just punt. Sometimes you can punt on FanDuel, you know, and, and just go, you know, with a cheap player. But shoot, most of these starters are they getting like thirty burgers, so I, I probably wouldn't go that route by putting a player because that means everybody else need to go for like forty. Then you know, so you can go that route too. Go top heavy and just punt one player. Um. DK, I would probably put DK a little different. You know, you, you want to try to put everybody in. You know, you put Quig. I like Quigley at, at captain. You put a captain, and you can probably fit everybody else in. Um, I like doing that. Like DK, I like to um pick the cheapest player with the most upside and put that person at captain. That way. You got a piece of that upside. It's not a guarantee they're going to give you that upside, but it's a possibility they can give you that upside. And it left you some salary to play with also. So that's how I strategize on, on DK. But you can you can go with the top player. You can go with Sabrina, Kenneth Parker, Vandersloot. You know, the, the odd one out for me is probably Mieseman because she really ain't been doing nothing. Um, the cheapest I go on DK is probably... Man, ain't nobody else really playing. Um, the Chiefs thought I'd go maybe Gardner. But, I mean, if they decide to play Sammy Whitcomb, they played her 19 minutes. But that was a blowout, and she got that blowout run. The first game they won, she only played 12 minutes. So, that's what I'm saying. It's like, if you, if you punt, man, they might not get no minutes. Depending on how the game goes. Now, it could be a blowout, and they get good minutes. I don't know. I'm just giving y'all scenario on this slate. So, uh, Dangerfield played 14 minutes. So, you could go there on DK. But I think that's that's the lowest I'll go. Um, could be a blowout. It could be a close game. We don't know. Um, not, not easy, but uh, we're going to handle business. And uh, that's it for this uh, video, this one game slate. And uh, make sure y'all go subscribe to my other channel, Spacing That. Go show your boss some love. Click link down below to go subscribe. Hit the like button for me, please. And, and comment what you think about this game. Who y'all think going to win today. And that's it for this video. I hope everybody catches today. I'm gone. Peace.